Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. It's been a few weeks since the last one now, um, for reasons I'll go into a little bit more about later in the video. Firstly, hope you're all doing well and uh, welcome back. I'm actually back on the Isle of Man now due to those uh, unfortunate personal circumstances, but yeah, been in isolation just over a week now and uh, after two negative COVID tests, um, thankfully we're allowed outside for a little bit of exercise, just one hour, so uh, I'm going to take full advantage of that today and head out for an hour on my bike. As you can see, already kitted up. It's typical Manx weather outside, it's blowing an absolute gale. I think it's about 55 mile an hour winds today and uh, I think there's a little bit of rain in the forecast as well. So yeah, we'll see how it goes, but um, it'll be nice to just get outside and uh, clear the head a little bit um, and enjoy riding on Manx roads again. I'm just going to head downstairs, grab my bike and uh, I'll see you out there. Yeah, out on the bike this morning, clear the head, as I say, pretty windy out here but sun's out now, decided to come straight up, uh, straight up the mountain, just to stay away from, uh, stay away from the town centre and anyone else, so yeah, heading up, heading up the mountain, going to turn off here into Mackle now, just do a few laps around there, and then head back within the hour, not getting too far away either, so that's always sensible. So I'm actually on uh, my, I think it's 11th day of isolation now. So yeah, as I say, two negative tests and uh, you can have some exercise and I've definitely been enjoying my time outside the last couple of days. The weather's not been fantastic, but just to get outside and you've been stuck in inside is uh, yeah, a nice little relief and a nice little breather. But I suppose I haven't really explained the reason that I'm actually back on the Isle of Man. Unfortunately, last week uh, I lost my nan. Uh, she passed away in hospital after struggling for a few weeks, which was yeah hard to take. And it's not been the easiest period for me over the last few weeks. Hence my absence off social media and, and the videos and stuff like that, because it just hasn't felt right, to be honest. So I just want to jump back on the videos and uh, yeah, kind of get back into a, a normal routine whilst trying to cope with this as best as I can. And uh, one way I have been coping with it is obviously going out on my bike and getting the training done, kind of keeping the mind active and uh, yeah, the videos are another good way of doing that. So yeah, I'm going to try and get back into a routine of bringing you a video each week. So yeah, I look forward to showing you some more of this beautiful island and uh, roads that I've trained on all my life and grown up on and uh, obviously had so many amazing memories over the years with uh, with friends and family including my nan so it'd be nice to revisit some of those places and show you guys along the way so hope you'll join me for them in the coming weeks and uh, yeah for now I'm gonna get on with this uh, hour because I haven't got long get this 20 minute zone 3 effort done and uh, yeah show you a little bit of the island there and hopefully not get blown off because it is pretty breezy out here today so let's get on with it one of my favourite views on the island to be honest. Told you it was windy. So there we go, that's the effort done. And uh, just hiding in the lanes a little bit now, although they're pretty steep. But uh, yeah, that's what I love. Out the Isle of Man, you get such variety of roads, and they're usually so quiet as well. You got pretty epic views like this one. Got about 10 minutes to uh, to get back, so I'm gonna literally 
go to the top of this lane up here, back down into Ramsey and back into isolation for another few days. As soon as I get back to the main road just up here, it's all downhill, about two or three K into Ramsey and uh, yeah, I've enjoyed my hour outside today and especially with views like this, I can't complain too much. So yeah, just gonna get home now, make sure I get back in time. And then, uh, yeah, I'll catch up with you there for a, a little bit more of a chat because obviously we've uh, had to delay the competition winners and stuff like that. So we'll get on to that, shall we? So, yeah, see you back there. So, yeah, just got back off the bike now, had uh, had some lunch, chilled out a little bit this afternoon and... Uh, Watched the finish of Paranese and Torino Adriatico, which was uh, pretty exciting. So it's nice to have them on the TV and a bit of bike racing back on. Enjoyed it out there this morning. Nice to get out in the sunshine for a little bit, although it's pretty windy. So as I mentioned out on the road there, we've not yet had the opportunity to uh, announce the winners from the 2021 giveaway. If you haven't already seen that, you've unfortunately missed out. But thank you to everyone who... Uh, who entered the competition by commenting on below my YouTube videos of what they're looking forward to in 2021. So basically how we're gonna draw the winner is completely random. Um, so if you were the first person to comment on the video, then you've got the number one next to your name. And if you were the last person, it's actually number 49 because we've got 49 entries. So yeah, good luck to everyone who's, uh, who entered and thank you very much for getting involved. So we've got five prizes you can win and uh, I'd like to thank the companies that have got involved and supported this giveaway as well uh, so thank you very much for them but basically we're going to draw those prizes in alphabetical order so uh, if you're the first number out you'll win the cassai coffee for example which is the first one on the list um, and go down from there with the exception of the beers because they're a little bonus as well obviously if you're if you're under 18 then uh, you won't be able to win that i'm afraid but um, we'll have to work around that and cross that bridge when we get to it that's going to be between a Belgian beer and a Manx beer. Um, so whoever wins that one can get in touch with me and we'll arrange something for that. So I'm going to throw these numbers into the random number generator now. I've got everyone's name and number noted down on my phone. And uh, yeah, this is the first one that came up on Google. And uh, conveniently, it does five numbers at the same time. So we're going to, going to roll with that one. So we're going to generate these numbers now and see what it comes up with. So there we go. We've got number 19 which is Francesca Hall. Number 48, which is Stacey Hamlet. Number three, Richard Bennett. Number 25, Simon Brearley. And number 41, Alistair Jones. So there's your winners. Congratulations to you guys. You've won some pretty cool prizes there, if I do say so myself. But um, yeah, thank you to everyone who got involved. Uh, hopefully, We'll be able to do some more giveaways in the future um and yeah thank you for supporting the channel as well because without your support we wouldn't be able to do these giveaways so that's pretty much everything covered for this week's video guys welcome back to the channel thank you very much for watching um if you haven't already please do subscribe prize winners make sure you get in touch to uh, arrange delivery of those prizes and um i look forward to seeing you guys next week so thanks again for tuning in and uh, see you soon cheers